looks hard, but it is really simple to solve. I want to call this type of question as some contribution. Let's get onto the blackboard and see how to solve it. Let's go. Let's say I'm trying to create all the sets that contain one. So how do they look? One, and you can put whatever elements you want. And again the same, one, and you can put whatever the elements you want. And that's on till the last set that contains one. Okay, so one element that you can find. But if I ask you how many such elements exist, so how will you do that? So let's go back to the fundamental principle of counting to do it. So I'll fix one here in this place. So what am I finding? I'm finding number of sets that contain one. So one, I'll fix one here. Then I can have, I'll, I do have 10 places to fill and I have 21 elements uh, to, to choose from. So how will I do? So it's simply 21 C 10. So what is 21 C 10? It's the number of sets that contain one. Now if I ask you how much does 1 contribute to the total sum, you would say, Sir, if you look at 1, if I am trying to add all the 1s, it is 1 plus 1 plus 1. So how many 1s do you think I'll add? I will be adding 21 C 10, these many 1s I will be adding. And that is what is contributing to the total sum. Now if I, add, if I take 2, like let's say 2 is there, there. Instead, of, instead of 1, there is 2. Okay, so what will I do? 2 plus 2 plus 2. So how many 2s do you think I'll find? I will be finding 2 into 21 C 10. Okay? Like it's so on, till each and every number will come 21 C 10 times. And that is how much it will be contributing to the total sum. So I'll simply say it is 22 into 21 C 10. Here you just apply the sum of natural numbers formula to arrive at, to arrive at the answer. Now this will be your final answer. There you go, that's your final answer. Now if you want to solve more questions on this particular model, then do check out the description and don't forget to subscribe as I am going to simplify a lot of J problems just for you. Thanks for watching.